I have some point marked here. I have a lighthouse in the middle, and I have three boats, boat A, B, and C, marked at various points. And I want to measure the bearing of each of these points. So I want to measure the bearing of boat A from the lighthouse, which is L. Now, this, 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 these two words appear when we're trying to measure bearings of and from. From is where we're standing. So we're going to be standing on the lighthouse and we're measuring the bearing of A. So that's measuring how far we're turning from north to be able to find, to turn toward A. So at the moment, north isn't marked in my diagram. In a question that will normally have marked, we need to find out where it is. So I'm going to consider north as being straight up. So I'm going to mark north on my lighthouse. I'm going to get my ruler, and I'm going to measure, or draw a line, sorry, from my lighthouse to my boat. So I want to know, if I'm standing at my lighthouse facing north, I want to turn in a clockwise direction to face A. So this is the angle I'm trying to measure here. So I'm going to get my protractor, and I want to make sure that north is zero degrees. So when I get my protractor, it's going to be facing in that direction like that, with zero up here. I'm going to read around 0, 10, 20, 30. This is about 40 degrees. So that angle would be about 40 degrees. So the bearing of boat A from L is 40 degrees, but that fails one of our rules because there should be three figures. So if it's 40 degrees, I need to precede that with a zero. So it's zero, four, zero. What about boat B? I want to know the bearing of boat B from the lighthouse again. So from the lighthouse, that's where I'm starting. That's where I'm facing north. So I want to draw a line from the lighthouse to boat B. Again, zero facing north. My protractor is going to be in the same position. So it's in position like the semicircle is here. And I'm measuring this angle here. I measure out to the edge, so zero, 90 degrees. So it's going to be more than 90 degrees. It's an obtuse angle. It's going to be more than 90 degrees. And it might be, I don't know, maybe 130 degrees. So I'll say that's 130 degrees. Now, if you've got a protractor like I'm drawing here, a semicircle only goes up to 180 degrees. The third question might look a bit confusing. How do I measure the bearing of boat C? from the lighthouse? Well, I'm going to do the same thing. I'm going to start at the lighthouse. I'm going to draw a line that goes from the lighthouse to boat C. Well, what am I going to do? Well, I know that 180 degrees will get me to face south. So south is 180 degrees. So I know that's 180. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to get my protractor and I'm going to put it on the other side. I'm going to start measuring this angle here. So zero's down here this time. So zero, that's maybe about um, 50 degrees. So the bearing has to be measured from north. Well, around here, I've got 180 degrees to get to south. I've got an extra 50 degrees to get to C. So the bearing is going to be 230 degrees. So the bearing of boat C from the lighthouse is 230 degrees. So remember, always measure from north. If it's more than south, if it's more than 180 degrees, start measuring from south and add that on to 180 degrees. So let's have a look at this one. So solve x plus 2x equals 12. So what do you think you do first? Okay, well, I want x on its own. So I would put x equals 12 minus 2x. Okay, so a lot of the time we want to get x by itself. But what we want to do first is get all of these x's together. So can you see anything we can do with this? Get all these together in one place. Oh, okay, it's 3x, isn't it? Yeah, so absolutely. 3x equals 12. Oh, 
and say, Axe equals full. Brilliant, spot on, well done.